I think that's why I think all these scenes were edited out. I guess that means Anne Marie may not make it. I just said I wasn't going to predict, but I still think she's going to come back. I don't know. But maybe she won't. But there he is. Now Garcelle is getting ready with her glam. Girl Garcelle has gone full Hollywood on us. She don't go nowhere without that glam. But she says, you know, oh, you know, Gar she's got a lip sync. I mean, that's not nice. And by the way, because, you know, Madonna just fell off the chair in Seattle and like the track kept going. And even this whole tour, I've gone to three nights. Everyone's like, she lip syncs a lot of it. Does it matter? I guess that's what I'm getting to. Like, I mean, you're still singing a little bit. Like, does it matter if Madonna is up there lip syncing to her songs? I mean, I know that sounds crazy. It kind of does, but not really. It's kind of like reality TV. We know all this is edited. We know all this is a fake version of the person. But do we care? We treat it like every word out of their mouth is theirs and it's real. So do we even care? I don't know. Not sure. Um, so that's not nice, Garcelle. Shading Erica. Tis, tis, tis. Uh, PK is away 25 days and calls Dorit. And she would have been more upset, but now she's okay with it. I, I think Dorit, and, and by the end, he was away 39 days. I think Dorit and PK are going to make it. I really do. I don't think they're a couple that's going to divorce. I really don't. I mean, again, if they do... It won't shock me at all in any way, shape, or form. There's something strangely, I can't believe I'm saying this, strangely authentic about Dorit. I mean, yeah. I, 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 did I really just say that? Oh my gosh. It's early in the morning. Um, Kyle's party, $450,000 to put this on at the SoFi Stadium. Back when she first had the white party, there was a budget life was tough now 450,000 this is what i love guys this is why we watch beverly hills a $450,000 party $400,000 bracelet $70,000 earrings let's just buy it a horse named santos glam everywhere this is what i love on tv not even remotely close to the wealth of blank empire thank you for canceling that netflix not but sorry for the pause, guys. I can't do the show without coffee. I can't do it. I've been drunk once on air, once with our good friend, Catherine Edwards. I spoke to Catherine the other day. I sent her the reunion looks. I can reveal next week who her favorite was. We actually agreed on our favorites, believe it or not. Now, I love it. We see Faye Resnick walk in. We see Jeff Lewis. Heather McDonald ain't happy about that one. Where was her invite? No shade to Heather. But, I mean, why is Jeff getting invited and not Heather? I know. He's friends with Kyle, even though he says she's out of Zempic and blah, blah, blah. We see Camille walk in. We see Denise. It's so funny. Two things I thought when I saw all these people walk in. First of all, Alex Baskin other producers of RHOBH. I'm talking directly to you. What a waste. You should utilize Miss Donatachi Grammar Meyer. That is that is an asset right there. That is an asset right there. Camille to me, Camille and Kim Richards, those are the two. Those are the two. I appreciated Denise this season. I appreciate them all. If you want to know who I want back, it would be Camille and Kim Richards. There you go. I want them back more than I would take Lisa Renna back. Really, I think Lisa hasn't been gone long enough. You know what I mean? I don't think we're bringing Lisa back just yet. That's not the direction the show is going. I would bring back Camille and Kim. Really? Really? What are you doing? So when Camille walks in, that's what I think. That that's where my mind goes. I want my Camille Donatachi back. You really underutilize her this season. Really. That dinner party could have gone. I know Denise was fucked up and overtook the whole party and that, 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 that. I want Camille. As soon as Denise walks in, I'm like, oh, little Miss Rebel in pink. Apparently now we call it out. Dorit has an issue. D Denise is just, 
I love Denise because you look at all these 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 women and their 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 glam, and then you're just like Denise just strolls in, and it's so effortless. Like you know, Denise is just like cool. I went in my closet, and this is what I'm gonna wear. Like, what's the big fucking deal? When she says she, she's Denise fucking Richards, she means it. She's Denise fucking Richards. You know that outfit. She just threw it on and is like, I want to be a little different. Let me wear a little pink. And now we're making a big deal of her collar. And she's like, oh my God, once again, I don't fucking give a shit. I love it. I love it. She's a real person. Aaron, we don't even have any speaking time with Aaron. Oh God. God, oh God. Um... Kyle is making an entrance. The only person who notices is Satine. And Mauricio is eating. Kyle's daughters did not look interested in interacting with Mauricio. Is it just me? When Kyle, he's like, oh, look at you gorgeous women. My family. The daughters could barely speak to them. Are they angry at Mo? Are they angry at Mo? I don't know. I don't know. Um, my best dress were Kyle and Anne Marie. I got to give Anne Marie her props. I thought she looked great, but Kyle was my best dress. I mean, Garcelle, hard pass. Crystal, hard pass. Now, here's the good news we have the People Choice Awards looks. I gave Crystal my best dress. The reunion, I don't know. I have some interesting thoughts on the, the outfits, but for this, I'm going to give Kyle my best dress. Pass on Garcelle. Pass on, and I'll give Anne Marie second. Pass on Crystal for this. Sutton and Dury. Dury was up there for this. Yes, guys. Next week we're gonna talk about Dury three. I mean, look, trust me on this one. You know that? Do you guys realize that you can't just pick a reunion? Like, there's there's a theme to every reunion. Like it was Mexico, Mexican for Miami. Um, I assume this was like art deco, like high end art deco. That's the theme I get from this. But regardless, you realize you can't just pick a dress. You have to literally send your dress in and it has to be approved by Bravo in production. And it literally, they have to say, okay, like Dorit, you can't wear this. You can wear this. Um, if you wear that, Kyle, we were going to approve your first dress. But we just approved Dorit's, like, like say Kyle was going to have a different dress, hypothetically, and that dress was approved, okay? Then Dorit sends in her looks, and they have to, they love this thing with a hood for Dorit. Now they're like, we love that so much, that's locked, so let's lock that in. Now, Kyle's dress that we approved is no longer approved, because it just, for us, doesn't go with Dorit's. And this hooded thing of Dorit's, and I'm not saying this is my opinion, I'm just giving you an example. This hooded thing of Dorit's trumps Kyle's first dress. So now we have to get back to Kyle and say, you can no longer wear your first dress, send us your second choice. Or, remember that second choice? Let's go with that. That's so great.